Welcome on back and if you're new welcome on in if you're new and you like what you see and what you just seen Daisy with Caleb on their date I mean they spent the whole weekend together and it's now Monday morning <laughs> if you like what you see please hit that subscribe button make a comment like let me know what you think all right so today is the day after daisy got home last night from her rendezvous with caleb vator and uh yeah so it's, it's raining heavily it's raining in henford on bagley it's a cloudy day it is the summertime still but it's a cloudy day daisy is at home and She's getting some food. She just paid her bills. She actually just sent out one of her bouquets. It said the Grim Reaper has bought your bouquet for $40. So she just shipped it. Yeah, so yes, she likes cooking. So that was so cute with Daisy and Caleb. Oh my God. Yes, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed playing it. <laughs> Don't worry, there will be plenty of opportunity for you guys to see Daisy and Caleb live as we do this Let's Play. I'm quite sure he will be around a little bit more often. Even though, you know, things did, I mean, it was really, really good. But I still feel, there she goes, she is getting frustrated with the cooking. I still feel that Daisy is a little hesitant. Um, I just feel that way. <laughs> Daisy is focused. Daisy wants to focus on gardening and getting her flower shop open. And, hello, this is the Flower Legacy. I know we have to have an heir, obviously. But we have goals. We have things to do. We have to evolve five plants right too perfect we have to do that uh so let's see can we evolve any of these things and we have to finish our aspiration 
evolve five different plants. So <laughs> we have work to do. Oh, evolve, yes, evolve. Do I get a do I get anything? Daisy's hard work has paid off and her bluebell plant has increased to nice quality. Yes. That's only one. Not all. Hmm. Let me see. What else? Oh, evolve this one. Yep, evolve. Nope, not this one. Oh, it's only two? I don't know what else to do. Hopefully. Oh, well, we're not going out in the rain, so. Matter of fact, Daisy, change your outfit because that's not a rainy. And Caleb is calling. What does it say? Hey, Daisy, it's me, Caleb. Do you want to go out on a date to the nightclub, the Blue Velvet? Caleb, we just went through this. We just had, we just spent the whole weekend. Daisy just spent the whole weekend with you, Caleb. Hello? And it's like 10 o'clock in the morning. I'm going to say no thanks, and I hope it doesn't affect the relationship too much, but I will definitely invite him over, okay? Because I'm not... Daisy's not going to the club. She's not going to the club. It is raining outside. It's 10 o'clock in the morning. No, Caleb, no. Uh, what can she do? Is there like a gar... I wish there was a gardening channel. Is there a gardening channel? Um, no. I don't know what we, what we can watch. Dream Home Decorator. Go ahead, girl. Watch that. Matter of fact, this the radio is broken. You know we need our music. So don't even. Just repair that, Daisy. Repair that. Change your outfit. Let's have her change her outfit as well. Let's put on this cute little dress. <clears throat> Let's be comfortable. Okay, so two out of five. So we need three more plants to evolve. Let me check the lilies. I didn't check the lilies. No. Let's see. And then you know what, guys? Daisy is a part of that club. What's the name of that club? Oh, Daisy also needs to take a shower. So she's definitely going to take a shower before she calls um, the guarding gnomes. She is a part of this club, so perhaps we can have a club meeting soon. And then they can help Daisy garden and stuff. So, <laughs> yeah, right? That would be cool. We can um, have a, a meeting and, uh, yeah. But after she repairs that, she has to go use the bathroom. And I'll use the bathroom. And then get all nice. For Caleb, we are going to invite him over. Yes, we are going to allow vampires make sure that it's not on. Why is she dazed? Did she get electrocuted? Wahima. Wahima what? I heard you and Caleb started dating. Congratulations on landing a new boyfriend. Uh, hello? I don't think Caleb is Daisy's boyfriend. They just went out on a date. They just went out on a date. I swear they're not boyfriend and girlfriend. But okay. All right. We see how the rumor, the rumor mill is starting in Henford on Bagley. Wait a second. Let me check out their relationship. Because I swear they are not boyfriend and girlfriend. Open up his profile. Okay. So. Well, oh. That is her boyfriend. When did that happen? When did that happen? I don't remember. That's not what happened. <laughs> Did they do it on their own? Because I certainly was not controlling that at all. Okay. They are boyfriend and girlfriend. They are soulmates. Two Sims, one heart. Okay. Y'all are right. I hate you guys. Y'all are so right. Y'all tell me there's going to be some vampire babies. There's going to be some vampire babies. Oh my God. Okay. Let me stop. <laughs> Daisy's sentiments about Caleb. He, she is smitten with him. 
and deeply connected and Caleb sentiments about Daisy is friendly advice deeply connected hmm okay okay so Daisy definitely is a little bit more into Caleb than Caleb is into her so we gotta watch out for our girl Daisy okay we really do all right so okay she's day she got electrocuted you gotta clean up before you invite Caleb over uh, scavenge for some parts and then throw away do that before you take a shower then take a shower after it is really raining in Hedford on Bagley during the summertime Caleb, oh he's at you oh, he's cold oh someone's being a little obsessive answer the phone Daisy I'm happy you answered and I have exciting news to share I switched careers oh wonderful Caleb I didn't know you had a job well congratulations Caleb on switching careers what are you uh, uh, instead of a night walker you a day walker I don't understand <laughs> But okay, good for you, Kate. Is, is he calling again? Remember that job we talked about? I got it. Well, congratulations. They must have talked so much. They must have talked about everything under the sun. Because honestly, I do not remember <laughs> ever telling Daisy to tell Caleb to get a new job. But hey, all right, Caleb. Thank you for the phone call again. <laughs> All right, so she got a little plumbing part. Maybe we could use that later. Upgrade something. Okay, let's close that out. Daisy has learned that Caleb is a tough guy. A tough guy at Mob Wives. Oh, Caleb, are you working? Caleb, you working for the mob? Okay, y'all. This is my sweet Daisy, you guys, okay? I don't know if this relationship is gonna work out because first off, I didn't want Daisy to be with a vampire. I didn't want a vampire baby for Daisy. Now Caleb is a gangster. <laughs> He's a gangster. Oh my God, that's exactly what it said. Daisy has learned that Caleb is a tough guy at mob wives he's working for the mob wives okay oh my girl Daisy Daisy throw that out what else something else is stink in this house there is something stink hold on let me get a little closer I'm gonna spin just a tad there was I seen some green something somewhere over here why is she? No, she is. She's smoking. Daisy is smoking because she got electrocuted. I swore I just seen some smoke on Daisy. Okay, that's a cute outfit. You could keep that on. All right. <laughs> it's not raining too much. Uh, oh, Patchy. Yes, Patchy. Patchy, you getting to work on your own. Thank you, Patchy. Patchy, are you doing? Yes, he's doing the gardening for us. Oh my God, that's so nice, Patchy. Yes. Out of season, though. Patchy's doing the work for you, Daisy, because he know you 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 got electrocuted. <laughs> When you fix the radio, so he was like, oh, gotta come alive. <laughs> He's gotta come alive. All right, where he went? Patchy, what the hell are you doing? You rolling in the mud? Was he just rolling in the mud? All right, Patchy. We was gonna invite Caleb, but <clears throat> let's just hang out with Patchy. Let's get let's get close to Patchy. Let's tell Patchy a funny story. 
Daisy, where are you going? She is so dazed. Daisy is dazed. Okay, uh, don't know what that means, but okay. Hang out with Patchy. Um, talk about something. Ooh, tell them you're scared of vampires. You are scared of vampires, even though you're kind of dating one. Yeah, and he's like, girl, please, you are talking to a scarecrow. <laughs> How can you be scared of vampires? This world we live in, there's a lot of things, Daisy, and Daisy's been sheltered, really, most of her life, you know, living with Awella, she's been sheltered. She, she broke a couple of curfew rules because she just wanted to explore, but there's a lot of things out there in the sim world that Daisy doesn't know about. And that is what she's telling Patchy. And Patchy's like, girl, you need to get out more. <laughs> All right. So let's see. Oh, she's tired. It's only 3.30. It's 3.30. All right. Well, let's take a nap then. Let's take a nap in the Willis bed. Take a nap. Then you can get up, and then you're gonna call Caleb over and see what's going on with him. Okay, Daisy is taking a nap. She's almost done with her nap. But I think there's some flowers or some plants we can evolve. So that should be three. Well, let's see, this one, four. Come on, one more, one more. Five. Yes. <clears throat> yes, we completed one. Okay, so now we have to graft onto three plants and fertilize five plants, okay? We have to graft and fertilize. Okay, Daisy, come on, girl. Wake up from your nap. And call Kayla. Patchy's still here hanging out. It is pouring like cats and dogs in Hanford on Bagley. All right, so we got to call. Well, she's cleaning the toilet. Girl, let's invite Caleb over. Hello. Here, there we go. Okay. Invite Caleb over. Patchy's here. Patchy, you got to let Daisy know if things are okay between her and Caleb. Oh, Patchy! Oh, are you okay? Oh, there's Caleb. Uh, I don't know. Why isn't there a just hi? <laughs> Ask about his day. Patchy is going back. There he goes. He's done. That is at 6 o'clock. Where's she going? Where you going? Oh, girl! How embarrassing. Ooh, Caleb went over there to Patchy quick. He was quick. He was like, uh, what is this thing? Hi, Caleb. All right, let's, let's give him some, some affection. It's raining. Um... Oh, kiss in the rain. Oh, damn. Kiss in the rain. All right, Patchy, close your eyes. Because they're kissing in the rain. Kissing in the rain. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Caleb works for the mob. I can't get over that. <clears throat> okay. All right, so uh, let's see what we can do. All right, Caleb, can, let's go inside. And he likes video games. Okay. 
Let's watch a movie, Caleb. Let's watch a movie. Let's watch um something cute. Lost Dog Journey. Let's watch a movie. Caleb, don't bite me. Don't bite Daisy. <laughs> oh man, this is crazy how things work out. Caleb, can you like try to slow down just a little bit? Just a little bit so that, you know, Daisy can catch up to you. All right, it's, it's a rainy day. They are chilling, watching a movie together. Caleb and Daisy. Oops. You want to get a little closer? Don't be shy. Is there a snuggle? Cuddle while watching a movie. Perfect. Oh, she's upset because what? He doesn't like it? Oh, he's is he getting emotional? Yes, Caleb. He likes the movie. Oh. She is just looking at him like, oh my god, what am I getting myself into? Look at her. She ain't even looking at the movie. Homegirl is just all into him. Look at her. She's into him. All right, Daisy, you know, catch your breath. <laughs> she, <laughs> he laughs, she laughs. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, they're so cute. Oh my God. Oh my God, they're so cute. Oh, he's getting emotional. They're adorable. All right. <clears throat> <laughs> All right, what else can he do during the movie? Anything else? Let's see. Uh, hmm. Invite to stay the night? No, we're going to go slow. <laughs> we're not ready yet. Daisy's not ready yet. And that's, at least that's how I picture Daisy. I don't picture her to be like, you know moving fast I mean she she did kind of move fast because that's a boyfriend in a matter of like a weekend let's cook together Daisy's getting hungry oh god girl the movie it got you emotional all right let's cook give me the option cook together with Caleb hopefully he can cook can he I don't think he can eat but he can cook something with us, right? Okay, what can we, what should we cook with Caleb? Let's cook something. Uh, I wanna cook something that Daisy. And show him that she used to cook with her abuela. Uh, Bad de Guillo. Oh, yes. Cook that cheesy bread. I think that's the cheesy bread one. Caleb, I hope you like cooking because we're about to cook. And yes, Daisy still has the curfew at 9 o'clock for herself. <laughs> I know. Last time I said I was going to take it off, I totally forgot. I will take that away. But we might keep it. I mean, hey, vampire babies. <laughs> okay, guys. Enough with the lovey-dovey. Can y'all go cook? Yeah, she's telling him that, you know, you got to learn how to cook. Let me show you. All right. Daisy is inspired from that movie. She was comfy, homey.
she loves cooking oh she is just having a glorious time she's with someone special happiness swells within Daisy's heart just being around a sim she is in nor unarmored with I hate that damn word <laughs> And she leveled up in her cooking skill. Okay, Daisy. Hurry up and cook because you're about to, to go to sleep. Daisy and Caleb is cooking together. And that is definitely going to be a sentiment. Let's see. All right. Yes. Cooking together. Yes. And he has it too. So that's an added sentiment. Look at him. He works from 5 to 12. Every day. Why are you here? You should be at work, Caleb. <laughs> he is a criminal at Mobwise. I can't believe it. Alright. So they are cooking. And Daisy had her aspiration. She, she leveled up. Things are going so well today on this episode. I'm loving it. <gasps> Where he went? Where he going? What happened? Where he went? Did he run out? Did he leave? Oh, he's late for work. I was just talking about that. Damn, Caleb, you could have said bye. Oh, no, Daisy. Oh, well, more for you. More for you, homegirl. He just ran out like a bat out of hell. No pun intended. <laughs> no pun intended. Yes, he did. All right. I mean, hey, this was a great a look. I'm going to end it here because Daisy's about to go to sleep. She had a full day. Patchy came over, hung out with her, helped her in the garden. Caleb called her like twice, asked her out on a date. She didn't go, but he came over. They they watched a movie together. They cooked together. She learned that Caleb is now a criminal at Mob Wives. <sighs> yeah. I'm satisfied. We did it. <laughs> Good night, Daisy. Listen, guys, thank you so much for joining me today. Once again, if you are new, please stick around. Hit that subscribe button. And I will definitely see you next time. I am Simarala, and this is Daisy. She's going to sleep, and we will see you guys next time.